Greetings my friends and welcome to today's crochet bandana tutorial. Thank you so much for supporting my work. I don't take it for granted. For today's pattern, I am using um, medium size yarn and 4.5 crochet size hook. Also, I'd like to encourage you to turn on your notification bell so that you're able to see or get notified as soon as I upload new videos. So to start off, you're going to make a magic loop or a magic circle and we are going to chain three, one, two, and three. Next, we are going to make two double crochets into our magic loop. That is one double crochet and now this is a second double crochet. After that, we are going to chain three. Next, we are going to work three double crochets into our magic loop. One, two, and three. So after that, we want to close off the magic loop. After that, we are going to chain three. One, two, three. I'm going to cut off this piece of yarn and I'm going to tuck this in when I'm done. So after we have chained three, we are going to flip our work, chain three, flip your work like so, and we are going to work into this space here at the bottom of the chain three, and we are going to make some double crochets, two double crochets. Next, we are going to work into this center piece here and we are going to make three double crochets, two, three, and then we are going to chain three, one, two, three, and we are going to add three more double crochets in the same chain space, one, two and three so after that we are going to work into this space at the end or at the edge and we are going to crochet three double crochets in there three after that we are going to chain three one two three after chaining three we are going to flip our work basically what we did earlier flip your work like so because you when you flip your work you want to work along this edge here and we are increasing this as per our head circumference or per, as per our desired length and this is the pattern this is the same pattern we are going to be using to increase the length of our bandana so we are going to work into this chain space here at the bottom of this chain three and we are going to make two double crochets next we are going to work into this next chain space this is what we are going to work into and we are going to make three double crochets So when you get to the tip of the bandana, the pattern is make three double crochets. Chain three and then add three more double crochets in the same chain space. Next, we are going to work into this space here and we are going to crochet three double crochets in it. And then finally, at the end here, we are going to work three double crochets. So 
So when we get to the end, we are going to chain three and flip our work. This is the same pattern we'll be using to increase our bandana. So I'd like to show you one more time. So we are going to do two double crochets at the bottom of the chain three. And then in our next immediate space, we are going to crochet three double crochets. Next space, another set of three double crochets. And then when we get to the tip, remember we are doing three double crochets. And then we are going to chain three and add another three double crochets. So in our next space, we are going to add three double crochets in it. Two and three. In our next space, another set of three double crochet or just three double crochets because some people may, inter may interpret set to mean two, 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 two of three double crochets. So at the end, remember we are going to do three double crochet. And then we chain three and then we are going to flip our work and continue working along this edge using the pattern I have showed you. So I did make another bandana earlier and this is the size that I'd like. So normally you make about 10 to 13 chains, like for this is 13 rows rather than chains. I made 10 rows because this is wool, it's definitely going to stretch and I don't want such a big bandana hanging over my head. So I want to show you how to work the straps to hold on so that the bandana can hold on to your head. So once I was done with this side, I didn't cut off the yarn. I want to make 60 chains as part of the strap. So crochet 60 chains. Again, you want to measure as per the size of your head circumference. So I'm going to make 60 chains on this end. So once you are done attaching on attaching the the head strap on one side, do the same on the other side. And then you have your bandana ready. Thank you so much for tuning in, check on my work. I didn't take it for granted. Happy crocheting.